Hello my dear audience, my dear viewer, today I will be showing you in this video blog about information about Peshawar Zoo. So this is the map. First of all you should have a proper map because map gives you all the information in just a click. So just see it. It is Wildlife Department, Government of KP, Peshawar Zoo Master Plan. So this is the map. In this map you can see this is the existing tube well and then you can see waterfall area is entry raptor's cage hippo stemmes jurassic corner leopard house black sheep black bear elephant house and you have to take a screenshot so that you can get an ideal picture of what is happening in this zoo so this is bird cage you can see some beautiful parrots different varieties different species of parrots and some beautiful birds like in this picture you can see golden pheasant it is golden pheasant and it is called chrysolophus pectus it is zoological you can see okay these are some of the beautiful birds and now you can see the chokor partridge and scientific name of chokor is electorus chokor and it is found in pakistan india turkey iran and afghanistan so the habitat is bushes forest and some of the inclined are valid or terraced area so what are it's I'm translating the Urdu okay so what are its general characteristics it is the only bird uh, living on the earth which can't fly and you can see it living in different condition and during some dangerous situation it can it can camouflage itself it has got some extraordinary skill in camouflaging so it eats some plants, roots, insects, and seeds. And this is, it is from the phylum. It is class Aves, order Galliformes, family Physendia, genus Electorus, and species genus. Species is Chocor. Now entering to ostrich. And state house janwar aprindo ko kela na manu hai it is being prohibited to <coughs> give some meal or some fruit or some vegetable to the animals and don't feed me you can see it it is summer deer so this is ostrich shatamod is the largest animal on the earth surface at the time being and it has lost its capability of flying okay oh you can see it now from very close angle okay uh, this is uh, ostrich it is just uh, like cam of camel size gigantic don't feed me tell your children we have enough food so you can feed your children not these animals because they have their proper diet routine so oh this is beautiful deer you can see they are just approaching they are just walking so there is a great lesson for human being to start walking because these animals are walking okay. hello deer one is deer and one is deer d w e r d e a r so this deer is dear to me card is chinkara ghazal let me show you in a zoom way and so you can see Chinkara you can see her horns her beautiful horns have a look to this yes. this is for your information and finally we come to the ostrich cage 
I have shown on the other side, but it is now clearly visible. Scientific classification, it is from Candle in Emilia, Phylum Chordata, Class Avis, Order, Family, and Species S. Camelis dividers with the size of a camel. Height is 1.7 to 2.8 meters. You can see it. Body length is 1.2 to 1.7. And it is found in savanna woodland. This is the habitat. And this is how they eat. Okay. This is incubation period, clutch size, independent age, sexual maturity. They achieve at the age of two to four years. So this is quite interesting information. And let me show you again. And okay. It's gigantic, just like camel size. But unfortunately, they have lost their capability of flying because they haven't used their wings too much. So there is a lesson for you people. If you are not using your mind, so your mind will be stagnant and you will not be able to do something creative. So this is a signboard about ostrich and how it is distributed. It is in the Middle East and in Southern you can see it. He is just on his usual walk. So his habitat is desert area, and let's get section two right after two point four. And it's diagnostic feature: ostrich. I'm translating. Sure. Ostrich is the world largest bird, which, without having feathers can't fly you can see it, her neck how elongated it is and it is quite soft it's just like our esophagus and you can see the security guards they have some special affinity with these guards because they are feeding it Another beautiful creature of Almighty Allah. It is red necked wallaby. It is Arabian oryx. No, oh, Arabian oryx is. I have seen it for the first time. <laughs> Arabian oryx. Let me zoom it for you people. Oh, to lock horns with each other means that you are just fighting with each other quite querulously. <laughs> And uh, this is beauty of nature. Another beautiful creature. Okay, so these are called these special birds. You can see it. But due to the weather, harsh weather circumstances, it is quite difficult for them to survive because survival of the fittest is really interesting. It's a cactus plant, different because. Today is 5th June and it is World Environment Day and Pakistan hosts this decade of this day under the UN decade of ecosystem preservation. Duck. It's such a beautiful duck. The dachshund, the term dachshund has been derived from this structure. You can see how a dachshund occurred, which is used for heavy load. It's derived from this natural bird. You can see it, it's quite beautiful. Oh, nature is quite beautiful. Yeah, we must love it. Let me show you because we people are talking about quarantine, COVID 19. So, this is warning birds quarantine unit. And this is animals quarantine unit. Plants because on the area of World Environment Day, so we have to see environment so environment is everything around natural worlds in our, around our, ourselves is our environment so it might be plants animals herbs shrubs so it is called chinar plantatus orientalis medicinal value uses treatment of ophthalmic dysentery heel wound and toothache and this is palm plant you can see it 
and this dead palm another beautiful plant which is called soch chen and you can see the medicinal and its botanical name this pig plant fig plant it's quite because it has got less height but its fruits are quite heavy the fruits are hanging so high fruits we have come to come to the parrot's cage so this is bajrigar and you can listen to the beautiful chirping of these parrots oh what a how confident how bold they are they are arrogant they are proud so we human beings should be proud not arrogant that arrogant is a has a negative connotation this is leopard house you can see leopards how dangerous they are they are just in a bad mood always oh one is just you can see the one is just waiting for us oh sometimes they are just talking oh this is zoo keeper says if you put your finger in the enclosure the cheetah will bite you so this is just for the awareness to make the people conscious that how these animals are dangerous but we must love them so these are a special type of monkeys oh special monkeys so, this is a special variety of some beautiful cats so now they are just having their sleep in order to keep themselves active for upcoming time so have you enjoyed watching these beautiful animals yes okay what is your name manahel manahel and what's your name isa isa and your marjan and your amna amna so you should appreciate your father that they, he has taken you towards peshawar zoo and you have learned about these animal are you afraid of these animals or you love them love, love, love them. them thanks bengal tiger and you know bengal is quite famous due to its habitat for uh, tigers because this environment suits animals it's quite suitable the environment of bengal due to bay of bengal so these animals are quite happy in the moisture area we have heard about lion that the lion sleeps for 18 hours and still he is the king of the jungle of the forest and it's a reality you can see it now it's time for activeness and he or she is sleeping remember king is a king whether he sleeps for 20 hour or 24 hour so once you have there is a lesson once you have achieved some status then you no need to work <laughs> but it is not good so let's see to a grey wolf which we call beria wolf i let i am translating beria is the only animal which who don't see with the eyes of you can say sexuality towards his or her mother and sister and wolf is quite loyal towards her partner his partner and it doesn't make extra marital affair with other female so you can see it this is a poster about grey wolf uh -huh. classification in mammalia phylum chordata mammalia carnivora canis canis lupus and this the height and you can see it from very close distance the king of the forest is just having a close look on his grey <laughs> subordinates now let's have a look toward at jekal and you can see jekal so jekal is saying that i am a jekal and i have an important role in the beautification or cleanliness of the environment because when i eat something so i put it in a dustbin so it is for awareness oh, so you can see it i'll come here jekal Jekal, he is in a very 
angry mood because they have been close in case although they should be in the forest so they can walk freely but for awareness purpose they have just make such they have just have a cage and this is different varieties of they call and so this is different varieties of pheasant you can see it, it is different variety there are different varieties of pheasant you can enjoy it as well a blue pea fall which is called is more you can see it wearing mask has been compulsory for visiting Peshawar Zoo this is Jekal Cordata Mammalia Carnivora Canadia Canis Aures this is Bengali Tiger I have a close look this is Bengali Tiger this is Arabian Oryx you can see it this is Max Max and Candy were born in Peshawar Zoo on 5th June 2019. These are the first cab cubs of lions born in Peshawar Zoo. Thousands of the inhabitants of Peshawar welcomed them. Mr. Shahidullah Khan, Secretary of the to the government and and coincidentally I'm also Shahidullah Khan, but I'm afraid they have forestry environment and wildlife named these cubs as Max and Candy. Max is the male and candy is the female. These are red deers. So these red ears are dear to me. So red deer, deer. Such a minimal pair. So they have reminded me many pair, minimal pair of red deer and deer. This deer is dear to me. Black bear is a violent animal. So this is mentality that why we people are calling it violent. This is not violent. So we people, human beings make them violent. You can see it how in how much trouble he or she is because we people call it that violent so violence is found in the character of human beings as well human beings sometimes are more violent than animals lion in emelio cordata mammalia carnivora pelinoformia flerida phenotypia phenotypia and pelinomel the candy so the mix might be sleeping i don't know which one is male or female but these are born only in Peshawar Zoo so these two are the diagnostic feature of Peshawar Zoo this is Max this is Max and the other one was Candy Asian Black Bear this is Candy the diagnostic feature of Peshawar Zoo these are born inside Peshawar Zoo 